hello crazy coders welcome to yet another video today we will add a new feature to our quiz game so without further ado let's get started this is our quiz game user screen and when you press play game a question will appear along with respective questions and after attempting and pressing next button you have a next question similarly uh, next question until the last question after completing the last question you press next you have a score but uh, what we're gonna add today is this play again button when you press on play again button you will direct it to the first question okay so that's what we are gonna build today so let's code first thing is i'm gonna add play again button in the end so for that i'll just name it play again and it will be a button uh, which will be in our window main root and the text will be play again simple and command will be start again is a function which I will create and assign the functionality to this button okay and I will uh, for now it plays forget because since I don't want to show in the beginning only at the end so this is our button done okay but since it's forgotten we have to add we have to make it visible only when score is visible and score is visible when the number of questions are done so that's where also we want the play again button so i will just use the place method and i will place it at rel x 0.5 and rel y at point or uh, let's keep it at point 0.1 now uh, let's save it and run so uh, the same window appears and when we click on play again uh we have the next uh, buttons available and in the end we have a play again button uh, we have to func add functionality to it so let's do that so first thing uh, i will create a function like start again function and parameters will be none but here i will actually reset the score and question number since they are global variables i have to import it as global i can alter them in my function and yes i will make uh, the score zero and question number two one which is the first question after that what i will do is i will make our checkbox reset to zero all the checkboxes will be reset to zero in the beginning and after that i will give the question label uh, the first question text okay and similarly we will update the options of first option that is question number one question number minus one and since question number is one one minus one zero so the options list as we know will be getting the corresponding options okay uh, yeah question number yeah. similarly for option two we are doing the same but now this is like the first option from the first list okay uh, and similarly now what we'll do is we'll make the next button config as next okay since we are resetting it to one again but uh we will make the play button for the play again button forget and also score players forget because we don't want to just score because we are showing the question now i think we are done with the program so let's save it and let's run okay i have play game and i am selecting random questions and i'm sorry answers then in the end we have score one and play again button and when i click play again we have all the things forgotten but one thing uh, we uh, forgot to do is uh, make the root tag again because in the root we have questions right this is uh like this is a main window and this is a root window root frame basically in which our questions are all placed so i have to tag the root and yeah i think this will do we have to pack it because uh in like after ending after reaching the last question we uh, forget the root so that all the widgets become invisible and that's why we are like okay i will make this for that's why we have to make it visible again using that so now let's run this file uh, we have play a game and uh, okay let's get this one right we have score zero and we have play again button perfectly uh, uh because i made it 0.45 and when i play again we have the question and the corresponding options okay and we can play it again and again okay uh, that was it from this video thank you for watching and we will catch you up in the next video